Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to show you how to add Adaptive R6 into your game. So first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have a game like this and you're going to want to have it set to have players be in R15 like this. So you want to have the player that has R15 just like how it looks there and you can check to make sure it's R15 by going into game settings, avatar, and check under avatar type make it, make sure it is r15 do not have it to r6 it will not work so once you have that go to the link in the description and get the adaptive r6 version free and insert that into your game now once you have the adaptive r6 into your game you take that script and you go to starter player and then starter character scripts and that's it. Now when you play test your game, your character will look like this. And you'll be able to go in here, swim, swim in this water. Every animation is working correctly. You can climb. And yeah, it essentially functions just as regular R6 would. Now, the reason why you would want to add this into game instead of just going here and chaining it to R6 is because well it does this so for most people R6 is an issue but for people like me it makes your character look like this and it obviously does not look correct so if you want to essentially if you have an uh, R for a body or layered clothing on your Roblox character and you want it to show in your Roblox game but you also want to use R6 you would use this adaptive r6 feature and in general it's nice to just have in your game regardless because um if you as long as you have it in your game you essentially can make sure that anybody else who's playing their game has a smooth character has like a normal looking character throughout the entire time they are in their game so would heavily recommend you add this to your games so I guess players like me and anybody else who uses layer clothing or R4 characters will be able to enjoy R6 games. So, thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. Goodbye.